Hi, Susan Rudy here. All right, we're gonna do a one-legged pistol squat, okay? Now, this is a move that requires a lot of strength, a lot of leg strength, core strength, balance, so I'm gonna take you through some progressions. Really simple, you're gonna need a bench, a chair, and you're going to sit down, stand up, okay? That's what you're starting with, okay? You are placing the weight through the heel of that standing leg, okay, and of course if you need assistance, use your hands to push off, okay? So do about eight to 10 reps per leg until you get strong and you don't need your hands. You can place your hands eventually behind your head. Exhale. Now, if you're feeling knee pain, you wanna lift those toes up in your shoe, in your shoes, which emphasizes the weight through the heels, okay? And you don't wanna go too far forward. That puts stress on the patella and the knee and often causes pain. So you wanna make sure that you're uh, lifting straight up, okay? So imagine that you have a cup of water uh, on your head and you're driving with your legs straight up, keeping your chest lifted and open, and that's your starting part. Of course, you start with a bent leg first, and you can use in between uh, the toe tap for balance, and eventually you won't need that toe tap. All right, so that's the starting point. Next progression is you're gonna be standing and you're gonna hold on to something sturdy, okay? So same thing. So you wanna light, light on with the fingertips. Don't clutch for dear life. You just wanna gently hold on. And then of course, down and up. Bent leg first, tapping first. And you wanna make sure you're driving your body weight back so that you're not going forward again over that patella. And of course, even, evenly reps for both sides. Um, and if, of course, you do experience knee pain, then don't do it, okay? Uh, make sure that your alignment is right. And if that's um, right and it still don't, doesn't feel good, then you need to find an alternative. Now, again, make sure when you're dropping down, that you're not coming forward, okay? So hips stacked, um, knee, uh, shoulders stacked over your hips rather. And exhale on the lift, which is the hard part. Another way that you can do this is, you're gonna use a band and wrap it around. You need to wrap it around something sturdy and you wanna enough tension on the band you wanna, so that it can you know, withstand your weight pulling back, okay? So you don't want to fall backwards, okay? So if you have a band with not a lot of resistance, you just cinch up on the band to make it work, okay? Now, notice my body position. You don't want to arch that back. Pelvic tilt, shoulders down and back, and then start with these double legs, and then up to single, down, up to single, and of course, start with alternating, and then you're going to come down and up, single leg. Make sure that back stays flat and you're driving straight up, shoulders in line with your hips, and then of course, straight leg. Drive through that heel. Constant cue is lift those toes up intermittently in your shoes or keep them up throughout. And of course, you want to Switch to the other side. This is a great leg strengthening move. Great booty builder. And this helps you to identify weaknesses and the side that's your weaker side because we're not made perfectly symmetrical. You wanna start with that side and you wanna perhaps do some extra reps or add an extra set on that side to bring it up to par. I have this band around waist level, okay? Another option is if you've got a cable machine, stack it so that it's going to uh, 
be able to serve as a counterbalance. And I'm going to raise this up again to about hip height. Okay. And I'm just going to use this as an anchor. Okay. Show you here. Use it as an anchor. Again, got to use your mirror and monitor your alignment. And then one leg, pistol squat. And eventually you'll just be able to do it on your own. Okay. So up and down. And of course, you can hold weights at your side. And this builds strength in the entire leg, hip flexor, booty, thigh. It's <laughs> core strength. It's definitely a powerhouse.